In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable two-factor authentication in Call of Duty Warzone 3. So press start and we're going to be going to settings and then we're going to go to account and network and this is where you'll find two-factor authentication and you can see the current status is on. So in order to change this, you're going to have to go to a web browser, whether it be on your phone or your PC and type in Call of Duty login on Google and then select login Call of Duty. Now that'll bring you to this page here where you can enter your email address as well as password and sign in, or you can use a third party such as Steam, PlayStation, or Xbox. Now once you've signed in, it's going to bring you to this page here, and you should see your account name in the top right corner, so go ahead and click on it and then go to linked accounts. Now that's going to bring you to this page here, and then you want to select privacy and security on the left sidebar. Now that's going to bring up this page where you can change your password and just beneath that is where you'll find two-factor authentication. So this is going to improve security on your account. Let's go to enable and it's going to generate this QR code, which we're going to have to scan with a two-factor authenticator. So if you go to detailed instructions, it shows you a bunch of different authenticators you can use. Me personally, I'm just gonna be using Google Authenticator and then I'm gonna scan that QR code, which is gonna generate a six digit code that constantly changes on my phone. So once you've done that, it's just a matter of inputting your Activision password. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now, as well as the code that's being generated on your 2FA authenticator. So I just input those two codes. Now I'm going to go to activate and we'll see if this works. So now that two-factor authentication is enabled, be sure to show the codes. These are backup codes that you can use in case something were to happen. So get those. And under two-factor authentication, it should say on. And if it doesn't, just restart the game and it should appear. So hopefully this video was helpful. Like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.